Good morning. I'm Rahel Solomon with your morning digital news brief for Tuesday, February 12th. Salt trucks are loading up in South Philly as they continue to treat the roads. Right now, temps are hovering right around freezing, so you may encounter some slick spots on your way to work or school. Most major roads do have speed restrictions this morning. And Delaware was ready for round two of the storm as well. Del Dot's salt trucks are busy keeping roads and highways clear. It has called in workers from southern Delaware to make sure drivers in northern Delaware are as safe as possible. But, of course, you still do have to be careful out there. And SEPTA has activated its command center to keep an eye on the buses and rail so it can change schedules if necessary. The transit agency is advising riders to start their commute early just in case of delays. SEPTA has an estimated 1 million daily riders. Okay, so let's get a check on the forecast now with meteorologist Katie Fellinger. Katie. And Rahel, we've definitely got our fair share of some problems out there today with winter storm warnings, winter weather advisories posted. Basically, region-wide Cape May County, southern Delaware, not included in those advisories or alerts, but here's a map view of what you've got going on. Now, these will last through at least this evening, depending on your location. With time, though, the precip does turn over to rain for our area. So, specifically for the rest of this morning around the city, You've got the mixed bag going, right, with some snow, some sleet, as well as rain that freezes on contact. But by lunchtime, this should be turning over to rain if it hasn't already. And through the afternoon, in Philadelphia specifically, pockets of heavy rain are still scheduled to crawl on through here. So the PM drive is no really better than the AM drive has been. However, as we look forward in the forecast, we are clear of the storm come tomorrow, just a leftover shower of snow in spots. And we are actually back to full sunshine by Thursday. A little bit more unsettled, though. For, as we wrap up the rest of this week. For help. All right, Katie, thank you. And remember, you can always get Katie's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on cbsphilly.com. That's the latest from the Morning Digital Brief. I'm Rahel Solomon. Good morning.